An annual event held today at the Veterans Coming Home Center offered the homeless population food and winter weather gear. It happened to be extremely timely with the winter storm headed our way soon. Color 10's Ashley Eddy is live in Springfield tonight with how organizers hope to warn the homeless to be prepared. Ashley. Well, Bailey, a big emphasis is being put on where the homeless can go to find shelter, but the worry is that not all of them will head inside. I can thank God for it that I'm still alive. Rodney Peterson is homeless and says he understands how dangerous it can be outside in certain temperatures. Thankfully, people are letting him know he has somewhere to go. They uh, uh, bring it to Grace. And then from Grace, uh, another bus comes and picks us up and takes us to the shelter that they want us to go to. He said it's going to get colder, so it, it's, we're going to stay in there as long as we can, you know, as long as it keeps cold outside. An event held Wednesday at the Veterans Coming Home Center created a perfect way to spread the weather warning message. And we're trying to let everybody know here that Thursday is going to is going to drop down really fast and so they need to have a plan. But we've got hot hands and we've got gloves and and um, I believe we've got some coats and warm warm weather clothing here. But organizers say there's a few people they're very worried about. They have no place to get undercover and uh, many of them are under a bridge or in culverts and helping all I can and giving them pep talks to find somewhere to, to go if they can. I'm afraid that if they're even out and kind of covered up, they're going to be frostbitten. Mercy Hospital doctors say they do expect to see cold injuries, especially since it can happen so fast. Frostbite can set in within 10 minutes of being outside. I think what we're going to be seeing most likely is frostbite. Um, there will certainly be cases of hypothermia as well. Um, and we'll just have to deal with those as they come in. The Mercy doctor tells me people really need to limit their time outside. If you do have to be out, make sure you have multiple layers on. Reporting in Springfield, Ashley Eddy, Ozarks First.